All right, um, we're going to do a brief overview of a John Deere hit and miss engine startup procedure. First, there's a couple things to check on these little things, so if you'll come around to me here. Um, there's two points, points on this engine that you need to check. First is going to be this one. It's going to be a little tough to see in here. But this is your oil port, or fill port, I should say, which also serves as a check. The John Deere engine would be outfitted with a um, funnel from the factory, so really, and it's going to be tough to see in here, but obviously oil. <laughs> there's going to be a oil on the bottom of your threads. As long as there's oil on the bottom of your threads, you're okay. This one, we know that. Gas fill is right here. Um, so that's all you really need to know on these. Um, as well as... Max will go over and show you a couple of oil points on the engine, point out a couple of those. There's little holes on stuff to lubricate your engine previously to starting. Um, and also... Yeah, and just as a general thing that I do on these as well, if, I, if they haven't been started for a while, is you just push the valves, make sure that they move. The intake, obviously, much later spring, moves a lot easier. Um, and then when you push this arm, that igniter should trip, and you should get a click out of it like that. Um, this one doesn't have any water in it, so we're not going to be doing a super long run. Also, hope it has gas in it. <laughs> so, um, really, come down here to the mixer. This is just a mixer, not a carburetor. So there's a needle valve and a fuel line coming from the tank with a check valve in the tank. Oftentimes if those check valves are plugged up, they won't pull fuel from the mixer, but I generally just put my thumb in that. It works on a three horse as well. Six horse, the opening's a bit large. And wheel it over a bit until it draws fuel. Got fuel there. So this one, it should start taking a wire out of me. And you adjust your mixer until that's a clean exhaust. So a little bit of black smoke doesn't hurt. Really, they like to run that way. This really applies to all of them except for the six of the power engine. So thanks, guys.